Betelgeuse is a colossal red giant located in the Orion constellation and shines brightly in the sky. This massive star is so large that if placed where our Sun is, its surface would stretch out to Jupiter's orbit. That incredible size would completely engulf Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars, leaving no room for their orbital paths in the solar system. Such a massive phenomenon makes Betelgeuse one of the most fascinating objects in the universe. The star is now nearing the end of its life, a final phase that promises to be unlike any explosion skywatchers have ever seen. As it approaches this conclusion, Betelgeuse holds the potential to transform our understanding of how stars live and die in the vast galaxy. In a universe filled with wonders, few stars stand out like Betelgeuse, glowing fiercely in the night sky. This red supergiant has drawn attention for centuries from both astronomers and curious observers. Today, Betelgeuse is a key subject of scientific research as scientists try to understand what its dramatic behavior means. Some believe it's showing signs of a powerful cosmic transition that will reshape stellar evolution studies. Its sheer size is hard to grasp, roughly 764 times larger than our Sun, stretching across vast space. Its outer layers would reach beyond Mars, making it a planet-swallowing giant. Betelgeuse has already used most of its hydrogen, and now it burns helium and heavier elements deep in its core. Gravity is collapsing its core while its outer layers continue to expand outward like an inflating cosmic balloon. If placed at the center of our solar system, this expansion would cover the orbits of our inner planets in a burning blaze. This kind of unstable phase is hard to predict, especially with a star so massive in its late evolution. Understanding this process is vital for astronomers because it shows how massive stars like Betelgeuse die. What happens at this stage could reveal how matter is recycled across the cosmos. Betelgeuse wasn't always a red giant. It started as a blue star burning hotter and brighter across the heavens. Over millions of years, fusion transformed it into the cooler, swollen supergiant we now see. Inside the core, atoms fused, giving off immense energy that powered its brilliance and growth. As fuel ran low, the outer layers expanded, cooled, and took on the distinct reddish hue we recognize in the sky. This color has made Betelgeuse stand out for centuries, glowing against the backdrop of distant stars. Its cool surface temperature gives it that unique, soft glow not seen in stars like our sun. One of the most mysterious things about Betelgeuse is how its brightness changes over time. It is a variable star, meaning its light levels rise and fall in the sky. But in late 2019, something more dramatic happened, a drop in brightness called the Great Dimming, which shocked the astronomy world. By early 2020, its light had faded to historic lows. This sudden dimming stirred questions. Was this a sign of a coming supernova or just a temporary cloud of dust? Observers around the globe turned their eyes to the Orion constellation for clues. While red supergiants do dim, the scale of this event was unprecedented, and researchers scrambled to interpret what was happening inside this massive stellar object. If Betelgeuse is on the verge of exploding, it would mark the end of its life as a red supergiant. The final act would be a supernova, one of the universe's most powerful events. A supernova would unleash energy so great that Betelgeuse would outshine all stars in the night sky, possibly even the moon itself. For weeks or months, it would cast brilliant light across the darkness. Though spectacular, the real value lies in the science. The blast would send cosmic rays and neutrinos flying at nearly the speed of light across the galaxy. Earth's magnetic field and atmosphere would shield us from danger, but detectors could pick up these neutrinos offering a rare glimpse into a star's final moments. These readings would let us explore the inner workings of a dying star, unlocking new knowledge about stellar death and what follows after the blast. After the explosion, Betelgeuse's remnants will scatter into the cosmic void, launching heavy elements like iron, gold, and nickel through space. These elements, made in the star's fiery core, are essential for new planets, new stars, and possibly even life. Everything from your blood to your bones contains matter forged in such explosions. So Betelgeuse's death will also be a rebirth, feeding the endless cycle of matter in the universe. In this sense, the end becomes a glorious beginning. 
One day, maybe millions of years from now, these elements might form a new Earth-like world, built from pieces of what once was Betelgeuse. This red giant's final explosion will be a celestial event that echoes through the galaxy. Whether it happens in 50 years or 50,000, it will change how we see the cosmos. For now, Betelgeuse remains a glowing light in the Orion constellation, a cosmic clock counting down to a grand finale. As it continues to pulse in the heavens, it keeps astronomers watching and wondering. This ancient giant has long captured human imagination, from early star watchers to modern scientists scanning the skies. One day, all eyes may witness its final spectacle. Betelgeuse will forever be a symbol of the universe's mystery, a star that bridges death and creation, shining with purpose in the infinite space. Each glance at its red glow is a reminder that the cosmos is alive, full of change, and far beyond our everyday understanding. As we look up tonight, we know that Betelgeuse waits for its final brilliant moment, preparing to write a new chapter in the story of the stars. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.